Alright guys, welcome to part 7, and uh, in this one here we're gonna actually uh, get this, uh, this dungeon done. And um, so this one, um, this this dungeon here is uh, a bit tricky, um, you, can, you can get uh, a bit lost here, uh, but you, you should be able to find your way out if you need to. Uh, so, so in this one, uh, this uh, dungeon here, I actually, um, <laughs> I, I only died like once in this, uh, in this dungeon here, but it's like at the end uh, when I'm fighting the boss, and it's just whatever. So, uh, luckily I had, uh, my two fairies in my bottles, uh, when I came in here, so I should be all good. So, um, so what I'm doing here is I'm actually going down, uh, going down this way, <laughs> failing miserably, and, yeah, that stuff is very finicky, you gotta have to kind of time it just right for them to walk right into it, like that, and, <laughs> aiming is really, really bad with the bow and arrow. So, I'm going down this way, and, uh, this way is to get a, uh, I believe it's to get a key. Um, uh, it, this dungeon here, I actually do, uh, utilize the, uh, the, um, the mirror to go back to the beginning a lot, um, due to, uh, there was some stuff that I might have forgotten, or it's just a quicker way to get to where I needed to go. Um, but, uh, yeah, that was a bad idea. Uh, so this one here, uh, you can bond, uh, both of these sides here. Uh, the one to the left here will bring us to a key. And, um, so we're gonna be going that way. And that's one of the keys that we'll need. And, um, yeah, the other side it just has fairies on it like that. So if you need some fairies, there you go. It's an easy way to get some fairies. Uh, so, uh, right here I use the mirror. And I'm just like, I don't want to go through all that, so... Uh, one thing I, I, I... wasn't like I forgot to do, it was just uh, something that I did, like, way later, is, uh, I, I should have gone down on that left path there. Uh, that one actually does have a key that I will need. And, uh... Yeah, uh, so if, uh, you need to actually, um, you actually do need a key to, uh, to get to the big key. And what I'm doing here is I'm actually going through this route right here, uh, to get one of the keys. And then you just use this portal to get back where you were. And, um, so then... Uh, on the other side, from where I initially dropped that thing there, um, that drops down on its way to the, the big key. And, um, yeah, like right here, when you go on this left here, you just bomb this little crack on the floor here. And, uh, when you drop down there, uh, you'll be on the ledge, uh, um, in the room where I was. And just on the top here, and you just use use the key on that door there, and this chest right here is the big key. And, uh, I'll use the mirror again. And then, uh... So, uh, so then I go... Uh, I do eventually go get the, uh, the hammer, which is, uh, this treasure, um, for this dungeon here. And, um, there will be a point to where I'm like, oh, I need a key. And there's actually, uh, in this room here, um, down in the lower right of the room, there's, um, you might be able to see it, that chest right there that you see. That's a key, and I will, I will be needing that, uh, I'll be, I'll be going after that, uh, here shortly, because, uh, I'm, at this point here, I, I don't have any keys, and uh, the, the um, upper left um, door up there uh, needs a key. And this is me trying to, me not 
remembering it right to, uh, that I need that key over there. Um, this is me trying to, uh, this is actually how you're supposed to get up there. But, uh, but since I don't have the key there, I'm like, oh snap, I need a, I need a key, so, um, so then I see the, see the, the chest down there, and I'm like, oh yeah, I need to get that, that over there, so I go around. And, uh, yeah, basically it's, um, just being sure to get on all the keys in this one, because, uh, this one you will utilize all the keys, like, uh, there aren't, like, extra keys in this thing, so. Um, there you go. Now, in, uh, in this one here, uh, you need to actually book it, uh, because the floor will be, um, like, you can hear that sound there, the, the, uh, yeah, that the floor is breaking away. So I need, I still need another key here, and um, I'm gonna be going down the. It doesn't matter which side that these two go to the same room. Uh, but in this room here, there's actually quite a bit of rubies. Um, I would say probably two to three hundred rubies, I would think, because they're all like buys and stuff. So it's, there's a quite a bit, and. Um, uh, you, you can you can use the uh, the the uh, magic powder to uh, get rid of those um, those things there. They, they will uh, turn into to fairies if you do that. Um, actually, I think I do demonstrate it uh, a little bit later uh, in one room. But uh, so yeah. So now we're going back to the uh, the door over here, and um, this will lead into a maze. And it's, uh, it's kind of, you should be able to figure it out. I mean, it's not, um, it's not hard to, uh, to navigate. So, uh, in this room here, you actually, uh, get a key, but, uh, there will be a, um, uh, a wall that you need to bomb to get to the big, uh, the big chest there. And that's where we'll get our hammer. And right here is where we get the key. And then right around here, right there, that's where you uh, use your bomb. And uh, I have actually seen some speedrun tactics where they actually go through the little barrier around the the, um, the the big chest there to get it like really early without using a key or whatever. Uh, so yeah, I would look that up. I would look up some speedruns and uh, see. See, you'd, you'd see some very interesting uh, speedruns. Uh, this game is beyond like glitches that you can utilize that will get you far. And, that's just ridiculous. But uh, we're we're doing this all legit, so <laughs> so we're gonna be um, so. Uh, at this point here, um, I go to, um, I, I go to the, I go through the right door over right here, um, at some point here, <laughs> as soon as I get the, uh, the blue, uh, thing active, and, um, I actually, uh, need another key, and I don't realize it until, um, I get to the end, to where I see the, the, um, the, do the door that needs the key there, and um, that's the uh, the one I was mentioning earlier was uh, the one on the left path there. So, um, so for the sake of, of uh, you know, I I, I edited the the thing out there, so I'm, I'm kind of watching the edited uh, portion here, so you'll see some edits here and there, and <laughs> this is me. Doing okay, I guess, with the, these guys here. These guys can be kind of kind of weird because the the um, the green guys they they follow you uh, directly, but the uh, the uh, uh, the red ones there they they actually go um, they go opposite of you, and um, if they look at you, they actually fire um, 
fire something uh, at you and it will hurt you. So you just, uh, sh you know, like in a previous uh, dungeon here, you just shoot the eye of this statue here. And uh, this wall will move and reveal um, a staircase. And you will need the hammer to go down this way. So be sure to go get the hammer before you come down here. Um, well, actually, you will need the hammer because um, you actually really need it for the uh, the boss here. So yeah, those things that the thing I just destroyed there, it's uh, it's much easier to just destroy them with um, just hit them with um, pound the ground with your hammer to turn them over, and then hit them with your hammer like directly, uh, and that will kill them instantly. Because uh, as of right now, your sword is a little bit weak, and it will take about two swings to, to get them uh, all done. And uh, so yeah, so I do um, a little cut here shortly. Um, actually, I I go I show you uh, I actually don't do it right away. I I go to I go to the beginning here, and I go yeah I probably need to go to the left because I had been to the right already. Um, so, I go down this way, and as soon as I get the key there, it's going to cut to me back at the staircase. Um, going back down there uh, where I was, uh, so I can proceed. So, you'll, you'll see as soon as I get the key here, and then, and there we go. Power of editing. <laughs> So now that I got the key there, now I, now we can uh, we can proceed. And I just cut that stuff out there, so you don't have to, to see the same thing again. Uh, it's just basically the same way on the way here. So yeah, like I said, you'll 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 see a lot of those. Uh, this dungeon, I guess, in particular, is uh, more notorious for these uh, things that you get to use the hammer on. Um, um, like I said, just use the hammer on them, and um, I also be sure not to use the hammer on them, uh, like near them, or else they'll, they'll um, get back over, uh, like you've been seeing. And this is me uh, going to my lantern uh, to light the room here, so I have a better thing where everything's at. It also lights this room here too, which um, there's already some lanterns in here already, but whatever. So this is the path here to the the boss here, and, and I just do it like I did there, and, and this is me like, oh, I need I need those fairies to get more health, but uh, I do okay. Uh, this boss isn't really too hard. Just uh, just be careful. Uh, as soon as um, his um, mass breaks, uh, you can whip out your um, your bow and arrow, and you can hit the the green uh, thing on its head there, like I'm doing right now. And uh, try to go to town on it, cause uh, if you got enough arrows, cause uh, you can get them down really quick. But uh, right about here, I believe, and die. <laughs> <laughs> so, and uh, it doesn't take too long for me to defeat him. There we go. <laughs> I was really close, but uh, not close enough. <laughs> so this boss is defeated here, and we actually get our very first uh, crystal here. And uh, this is um, one of the princesses uh, trapped there. We release her. And uh, each time we actually, uh, now this time uh, when we get these crystals there, the, um, one of the maidens here will um, kind of give us a little backstory on something. And uh, this one here is going to deal with um, a little bit about Ganon and why he's the way he is, but uh, it's whatever. So, um... Well, like I said, we got our first crystal here, and uh, this is where we'll end the part here. And, 
We'll just get a little backstory. And, uh... Just a little backstory. So, uh, I will catch you guys in the, uh, the next part there, so make sure to uh, subscribe and uh, be sure to like the video as well. So, take care, guys.